Okay, I'm standing in plant C at the stern of one of our flagship models, the 420 LXF. And what I wanted to do is take a few moments to explain what the differences are in our methodology and what's the norm in our industry. There's a lot of customers told a lot of different things about uh, methods of building boats, but Scout is truly unique in both the materials we use and the process that we use to apply those materials. One of the most significant is the fact that from our 35, 38, and 42 foot models, we use epoxy infusion and in the 38 and the 42, we also introduce a carbon hybrid, which is a carbon e-glass combination. And to give you an example of what that looks like, this is actually a, a section cut out of the 530 hull that we're currently building the prototype in. And this is where the uh, bow thruster goes. This, this piece is carbon fiber, epoxy infused, and it is significantly stronger in tensile strength and more rigid than what would be traditional methods in building a composite part. This is a piece of carbon e-glass hybrid and it's sandwiched, this is e-glass that's sandwiching carbon fiber in the middle of it. Now to let you know why most builders and most competitors don't do what we do, a lot of that's related to cost. Epoxy is four to five times higher cost than resin, which is what most boats are built out of. And the carbon e-glass combination is also four to five times more cost. The other thing that's different is that every epoxy infused part that we build is post-cured. What that means is that we heat these parts to 135 degrees for eight hours. And that's a process that a lot of builders really shy away from just because of the cost of doing it and the expense of doing it and slowing down the process of building the boats. So there's a, there's a big difference in the construction methodology that Scout uses versus what is the norm in the industry and that's what sets us apart from everybody else that we compete against.